So we get to play this weekend, and we're really excited. Um, today's Thursday. It's our favorite day of the week because we do our Thursday night concerts. And our Thursday night concerts are from 5.30 to 7.30 at the Historic Park. Mm -hmm. They are free to attend, and they benefit a different nonprofit every week. How great is that? Yeah, it's so a win-win situation right there. Right. So you can't bring in any outside alcohol, but you can purchase it. And every, Perfect. every beer you purchase goes towards a new nonprofit. Tonight's nonprofit is the Carriage House Early Learning Center. Wonderful. And tonight's music is Pa Cow by All Means. Okay. Really weird name, but super fun <laughs> band. Um, they are like African groove music. And so How we, groovy. I know. I am positive <laughs> you will be out there dancing. Absolutely positive. Okay. <laughs> awesome. And to find more information about um, all of your concerts, we can go to... You can go to townoffrisco.com. Our mm -hmm. event calendar has a full list and a breakdown. Also, Concerts in the Park on that page okay. can transfer you out to videos so you can see the music before you oh, uh, come. Oh, how great. You can test it out to, you know, just to be like, oh, this is what we're in for for the evening. But I find that, you know, there's always so many wonderful um, concerts around the county. It's always great because it's like, it's live music. You can't go wrong. And it's a beautiful setting. Obviously, it's a beautiful setting and you just you can't go wrong so that's wonderful yeah and our concerts in the park you know are pet friendly bring a blanket bring your camp chairs it is really a community experience when you get out there you will never have as much fun at another happy hour as you do at the concerts in the park well it sounds like we've got something to do tonight that's great yeah. and that and what time again was that that starts at 5 30 and it's um there tonight at the historic park okay. so first in maine Okay, and then um, tell me about how are the water levels doing at the marina? Well, it's our exciting news. The spring runoff has blessed the Lake Dillon Re Reservoir and brought it up uh, a couple more feet, which gives the Frisco Bay Marina mm -hmm. boat launch available. I know. That's so, so great. That is amazing, and it's great to hear just before 4th of July because there's nothing better than being on the water for 4th of July. Ugh. And we are so excited. We do recommend that you make a phone call um, because the water level still is down. Some boats cannot be launched from Frisco, okay. but most of your boats can. Um, it makes all our rental fleet completely available to you. It gives you so much more water to go play on. And if you have a boat and you're ready to get out on the water, mm -hmm. the best event that's coming up is this Saturday is the Timberline Regatta. Ah. And the Timberline Regatta is absolutely a blast. Okay. Um, we do both the Lake Dillon um, side of the marina, mm -hmm. um, launches the big regatta, and then on Sunday we do this fun cruiser regatta, and that's sponsored by New Belgium. So, of course, when they're involved, oh, there okay. has to be costumes. So, if you've never sailed before, this is actually, or taking your boat, this is actually a great race for you because you get handicapped by your boat size and you get handicapped kind of by your experience. So, it's a great way to start sailing and getting into racing if you've never tried it before. Plus, nothing better than dressing up. Of course, nothing better than dressing up and being out on, on the lake. It, it's wonderful. And I have to tell you too, if you haven't been on out on Lake Dillon, it's, it gives you a whole new perspective on the county. It's so beautiful. It, it's like, oh, you know, this is our backyard, but you're like, oh, it looks so different from here. And it's so beautiful and it's peaceful and calming. And um, also too, I have to mention um, the Island Grill over at the Frisco Marina is delicious. There's awesome drink specials and their fish tacos are really good. <laughs> well, one of the best things about the Frisco Bay Marina is it's not just about the water. Um, you know, we have a tumble bubbles kind of absorbing thing out there. We have the kids play park. We have, you know, all kinds of styles of boats from paddle boats to um, the, you know, the water taxi. So you don't have to be an actual like water aficionado. <laughs> you can go out and hang out there at the Island Grill or any place else and really have a great time. Yeah, it's true. It's a great spot just to kind of, you feel like you're, you don't have to be on the water to be out on the water. It's just, you know, you can get that nautical experience without even having to it's be It's kind out of our beach. Water. Yeah, it's totally <laughs> our beach. I know it is. And it's, and it's so, it's so, so beautiful. And all the staff there is really great to work with as well. So, and then real quick, we should talk about July 4th too. 
July 4th is really important. It's a very large schedule. So um, one of the things I love about Frisco 4th of July is that it's all walkable. I mean, Frisco is about a mile big from end to end. Perfect. And we use all that land to do 4th of July. Um, just to run it down really quick for everybody, we start with a pancake breakfast at 8 a.m. We go to a fishing derby at Meadow Creek, which is super fun for the kids. And then we um, have some music back at the historic park just before the parade at 12 30 and then after the parade we'll have more music we have a main street open market because all of main street becomes a pedestrian mall and then we put a finale concert down at the marina at 7 15 this year it's cody canada and the departed super fun band you're gonna love the music and then of course the largest firework display in the mountains and the reason why i can say that is if you've lived in summit county or if you've visited summit county last year all of us had to uh not run fireworks because of the fire ban. And so yep. we have a few left over, just a few. Oh boy. So oh. spoiler alert, very <laughs> big fireworks show this year. All right, very folks, so big. That? This, is, this is big. They've got some stockpile from last year's July 4th fireworks. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be good. So make sure you check that out. Um, for more information, go to townoffrisco.com. Um, more information for the concerts, for the 4th of July celebrations. Um, Suzanne, thanks so much for, for being here with us. There's always so much to do at Frisco. Do, do go check it out. It's, it's really beautiful and a really, really wonderful place to be any, any day of the week. <laughs> um, next up, we are going to talk about our pet of the week. We've got um, a shepherd lab mix. He's really cute. His name is Joey. And uh, he's a sweetie pie. And uh, we'll, we'll give you some more information on him when we're back on Summit Sunrise. Thanks for tuning in.